Hello everyone, and welcome to the channel. In today's video, I'll show you how to troubleshoot and fix the error message. This copy of Microsoft Office is not activated, which you might encounter in Office 2016, 2019, or 2021. Let's get started and fix this issue quickly. First, you need to know where Microsoft Office is installed on your system. Open File Explorer or search for it directly in the search bar and navigate to this PC. Once there, go to your Windows drive, usually labeled as the C drive. Inside, look for the Program Files folder, then open it. Find the Microsoft Office folder and double-click on it. Inside this folder, locate Office 16, as this is the directory we'll be working with. Once you're in the folder, copy the address from the address bar at the top. Next, open Command Prompt in Admin Mode. To do this, search for CMD in the search bar, right-click on it, and select Run as Administrator. When prompted, click Yes. In the command prompt, type cd backslash and hit enter to go to the root directory of the C drive. After that, paste the folder location you copied earlier by typing cd followed by a space, then right-click and paste the address. This will navigate you to the Office 16 directory. Now, you'll need to execute a command to check the activation status. Simply copy the command from the description box of this video, script osp.vbs slash status. Paste it into the command prompt and press enter. This command retrieves activation details for your office installation. If activation issues are detected, you can proceed to the next step. To fix the issue, run another command. Script osp.vbs slash rearm. Just paste this into the command prompt and hit enter. If you see Microsoft Office rearm successful, that means the process worked. However, if you encounter errors, Ensure all Office-related applications like Word or Excel are closed and try again. Restarting your system after running this command can also help resolve any lingering issues. Once your system restarts, your issue should be resolved, and your copy of Microsoft Office should now be activated. If this worked for you, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to the channel, and share it with anyone who might find it helpful. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.